Hi, I'm Anya. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I would like to show you my recipe for a whole wheat bread. It's not going to be a regular whole wheat bread. We're going to make it an onion whole wheat bread. In Polish we would call it um, chleb pełnoziarnisty cebulowy and it is delicious. Well, my kids are not big fan, so uh, it, is, it is a specific taste. Uh, it has uh, a lot of molasses and the onion, so it gives, a, it gives you an idea how the bread will taste. So if you're not fan of molasses, you can exchange it with the honey. If you're not fan of the onion, I don't think you should try the bread. But if you like onion, molasses, this bread is amazing. It's not a fluffy bread because we're going to use a whole wheat flour but it's really, really delicious and it is healthy for you. So I hope you guys are going to give it a try. And in case you decide to do that, let's have a look at the ingredients so you know what you need. I'm starting with adding the flour to the bowl of my stand mixer and I'm adding salt and I'm going to give it a stir just a little bit. Okay, then in goes the water. The onion. And the molasses. So as I said before, if you don't like molasses, you can uh, put the honey instead. Okay. The last is the yeast and then we let the mixer work for us. It's going to be around five minutes. We want the dough to be nice, smooth and elastic. And now, as usually, if it's too sticky, one tablespoon of um, flour at the time. And if it's too uh, dry, one tablespoon of water at the time. Here we go. I didn't have to add anything this time. The dough is ready. Now I'm going to knead it a few more times. Form a nice ball. And I'm using here my uh, coconut non-stick spray, but you can use any non-stick spray. I'm spraying the ball. Putting the dough inside. And then spraying the dough. Just we don't want it to dry out. Alrighty, and this is ready to be covered and then left to rise until it doubles in size. And it's going to take around two hours. Okay, now my dough doubled in size. I'm spraying my um, loaf pan again with the coconut non-stick spray. I'm transferring the dough on my working space, punching it down a little bit, flattening it, and then I'm going to roll it in, just as you can see. Tuck it in and roll, tuck it in and roll. And I'm forming a loaf of bread, more or less the size of my tin. Okay, here we go. All right, spraying some more. Again, we don't want it to dry out. I'm going to cover it with a plastic wrap and let it rise again until it fills in the form nicely. This will take around an hour right now. Well, it might take less or long, depending how hot your house is. Here we go, this is ready and my bread goes into the oven, preheated to 180 degrees Celsius, which is 350 Fahrenheit, for 35 to 40 minutes. Basically, if you tap on top of the bread, it should make a hollow sound, then you know it is ready. I'm going to let it cool down completely on the cooling rack, and then I'm ready to cut. I really enjoy this bread, the texture, the taste. It's a little bit on the sweeter side from the molasses, but really, really nice. I hope you guys are going to give it a try. And um, I hope you enjoy the movie. Please let me know what you think, as usually. 
Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. If you enjoyed the movie, please give me a big thumbs up and I will see you next Friday. Bye! Smachnego! Hi, I'm Anya. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I would like to share with you a recipe for mini pizzas. Uh, we would call them in Polish mini pizza and this is something what my kids love. 